So you've been in the military for a few years and you're transitioning out of service, or maybe you just got out. You joined up soon after school, made it through some really tough training, had a number of different assignments, got a couple of promotions, and maybe even have a couple of deployments under your belt. You've had some highs, you've had some lows, and you've probably done some really strange things just because your platoon sergeant told you to. You've had some proud accomplishments and overcome challenges, but you've also been scuffed up along the way. Military service isn't easy, and sometimes you get hurt in the course of it, whether physically or mentally. You've no doubt at least started learning about the veteran's disability system, and you're wondering how your disability will play a role in your post-service life. Well, now you're getting out. Maybe you planned on separating at this point, and maybe you didn't. But the important question is, what's next? What are your plans after separating? Where might you end up? Are you going to stay near your point of transition? Move back to your home of record? Go to school? Find a job straight away? Or are you going to catch your breath for a little while and then work on the life plan? How will your disabilities play a role in your transition? What kind of life will you want to build for you and your family? What will you be capable of doing in the civilian world? What's out there to help you navigate this change? Transition can be hard. There's an exciting new effort to understand how veterans with disabilities transition out of the military and use the disability system and what supports and tools are most helpful in getting vets where they want to be after service. It's called the Independence Project. It's a program combined with a Harvard University-based study aimed at understanding the challenges that veterans with disabilities face transitioning to the civilian workforce and how these challenges might be addressed. As a part of the study, some veterans may participate in regular paid surveys, receive ongoing career guidance and life planning, get support to pursue training opportunities, or benefit from incentives that reward productivity and employment. It's been designed by leading veteran service providers, world-class researchers, most important, people who are just like you, veterans going through the transition to civilian life. You can participate in this program from anywhere in the country, no matter your plans, and you will have the opportunity to earn a minimum of $1,370 for full participation in the study. What's more, your experiences and the information you share may help future veterans with disabilities transition more easily and successfully to civilian life. Your information will be safeguarded at the highest level at a top research university. It won't be shared with current or future employers or the government, and it won't be sold to anyone. If you answer yes to the following questions, you qualify to join. Are you enlisted? Under the age of 35? within three months of your in-service, pre- or post-separation, receiving an honorable discharge. Do you have an anticipated VA disability rating of 30 to 90 percent? If this sounds like you, apply today at independenceproject.org.